Hey, it's Nathan Williams with Crazy Eye Marketing, and in this video, I'm gonna show you how to remove a pixel from your Facebook ad account. Now, I believe this only works if you have a business, if you've gone through the business manager and you've set up your ad account inside a business manager. If you're using a personal ad account, I don't think that this method will work, but you can move a personal ad account into a business manager account, and then this method should work. So I'll have another video or another link somewhere to teach you how to move a personal ad account into a business ad manager. So anyway, you do need a business manager account to go ahead and do this. And I think most people do because that's the recommended way to set up your, your ad accounts. Anyway, so you've created two pixels or more pixels and you're like, dang it, I don't want this extra pixel in here. It's confusing me and you know, I don't, I don't, want, to, I don't want it in my account. So you cannot delete the pixel. That's one thing. So the pixel, once it's created, it cannot be destroyed. However, um, you can remove it from your ad account so it's not distracting you or you know confusing you or anything like that. Also, also note, like make sure you don't install this pixel on your website or something like that. Or if you did, make sure you remove that pixel code so you're not you know sending that information into Facebook or losing things and all that type of stuff. So. If you're removing the pixel from your ad account, make sure you also remove it from your website and all that type of stuff. So we have two pixels. We got my, my pixel that I want to use and then I got pixel two here that I accidentally created. So to remove it, what we want to do is come up to business tools here and we want to go into business settings. And again, I think this is where you need the business manager setup. Um, and again, I'll have a link to that somewhere uh, so you can go ahead and figure out how to pull in a private account if you have that. But what we want to do is come on down here to data sources then and we want to go to pixels and you want to go ahead and navigate to your pixel here so i got my pixel 2 over here and then we got connected assets right here and we see that it is connected to my my ad account my hq cat club ad account and we got this trash can here so i can go ahead and remove it so there we go so it's removed from my ad account so if i go ahead and you know refresh it my pixel here, it still, it still exists. Remember I said you can't delete a pixel, but you can remove it. So my pixel still exists. I could go ahead and you know add it somewhere else if I want to. So if I'm like, oh, I need to add it to another account or I could add it back to the other account or my original account. So I could add it back to HQ Cat Club and so on. So this is inside of, again, the business settings area and we just removed it. So let's go make sure it actually worked. So let me come back over to my ads manager real quick. And I need to make sure I'm on the correct ad account. I wish uh, Facebook would automatically bring you back to the ad account you're just in. That'd be helpful. So I'm in the correct ad account now. And now I want to come up to events manager here. And hopefully I only see the one pixel that I have in my account. So there we go. My HQ Cat Club pixel is the only one in my account here. And so that's, that's how you go ahead and remove it from your account. Now another side note, uh, this pixel is... I can't remove this one, okay? This this pixel is my account's pixel. So if you wanted to only use the second one you created, well then I recommend going ahead and renaming this one to like don't use or something like that. So that way you remember not to use this pixel but to use the secondary pixel that you created um, with your account. So you can't delete the, the original one but you can delete any of the additional ones that you make and Hopefully this helps somebody out. I've had this question a few times this week. So hopefully this you know, explains some things and helps people out. And uh, thank you. Hope you have a great rest of the day.